Welcome to our postcard from the London Tramlink. London Trams is a light rail tram system serving Croydon and surrounding areas in South London, including Wimbledon. It began operation in 2000, the first tram system in the London region since 1952. It is managed by London Trams, part of Transport for London, and has been operated by First Group since 2017. The network consists of 39 stops along 17 miles of track, on a mixture of street track shared with other traffic, dedicated track in public roads, and off-street track consisting of new rights of way, former railway lines, and one right of way where the tramlink track runs parallel to a third rail electrified network rail line. Like London buses, passengers can take advantage of the Hopper Fare, where you can take as many trams as you like for £1.75 during one hour. If you are wanting to take the tram at Wimbledon, you need to tap it on one of these green um, readers. And now let's go on to the tram. Never been on it before, but I think it should be a nice ride. And we're gonna go, and it goes once every like 10 or 15 minutes, I think. I think you'll find that we did actually go on the tram one time, so what was this? it obviously wasn't a memorable experience for you. So let's hope that today is much better. So, just one thing to note if you are getting on at Wimbledon, as Paul said, you tap in at the platform, but you must walk through the gates first of all and they are left open for that purpose. But make sure you do tap in on the platform, otherwise you will be liable for a fine. This is interesting, our first stop is Dundonald Road. Dundonald Road. It reminds me of Belfast. How far are we taking this? We are taking it to Bondle Park, and I have to say, there's not a lot of distance between each stop. Oh. It looks like the new Addington route goes in a bit of a loop. I'm not sure about these other ones, but I think it might have the same principle. Getting off now. Bye. So I've been telling you all about how to tap in and I just had this terrible thought that I didn't actually do it. So we're gonna, we're gonna find out what happens here. There's no gates anyway, so it's not the end of the world, but I've got my card. See, I'm losing, losing my memory, short-term memory. Let's see what happens. Please touch in. It will act, it says, you must touch your Oyster or contacts card flat on this card reader before boarding trams or traveling to Wimbledon with a travel card. The ballot card will show board tram. So it doesn't what? actually say that you need to touch out. Don't we? So this is really interesting. I wonder if you do. I don't think you actually do. Did you touch out? No. Do we not have to? Let's look it up. 
Because this is an interesting point. It doesn't say anything about touching out, does it? Right, this is interesting. It's similar to the bus. You only touch in, you don't touch out. And I think that's how they work out the hopper fare because on the buses and the trams, and this is another interesting thing, is that you can use as many as you like within one hour. So if we were to touch the reader again now, because it's been less than an hour, it wouldn't make any difference price-wise. Um, but there's no need to touch out. So we're just going to go out. We hope you are being entertained by our YouTube channel. If you are, please continue to like, comment, and subscribe. Well, as we've come to Wandle Park, I think we should take a wander around Wandle Park. It's just over here, look. Interesting park, though. It's nice to get some fresh air. And um, I mean, you're still sort of within well, the suburbs of London here. I can see some high rises across the way. I'm not sure if that's part of Croydon. I think it probably is. I think so because it's it is near West Croydon or something. Yeah. Do you think we're going to see any swans? <laughs> is that a river over there? There's a bridge. But I'm not sure. What's there. Well, we are quite near Croydon because it says it on this notice board here. Wandle Park is a great place to enjoy Croydon's heritage, sport recreation facilities or nature and biodiversity. It's the first place on the Wandle Trail and you can see the River Wandle. The park offers sports facilities, a children's playground, outdoor gym, bandstand and formal gardens. I think this is a nice looking park. This is indeed the River Wandle. This is indeed the River Wandle. There's a skateboard park and tennis courts. I wonder whether this wall was part of some sort of oh fortress back oh no, then. No. Ah. Ah. Oh my god! Oh no! No! Thank you for watching the show today. If you like what you see, please subscribe. Well, we've finished our return journey to Wimbledon and we've been on trams various times before in Dublin, Edinburgh, Nottingham and Athens. How did the London tram link compare to those, do you think, Paul? It was quite efficient and fast, I think. Yeah, I thought it was. They're very clean. Um, they're really, really nice trams, actually. As long as you remember to touch in at the station, but don't touch out again. Um, and I was panicking earlier. Okay, panic over. See you next time. Bye.